please. MikeSapps.com with an iPad app video demo for Windows Solitaire. This collection of Solitaire classics features the popular Klondike, Spider, and Free Cell games, as well as nice 3D graphics, 80 plus games you can buy, an interactive tutorial, and much more. Tap on play to get into the action. We're going to jump into Free Cell, one of the three free games. Klondike and Spider are the other two. Notice the old Windows Solitaire background. You can change the background. This is Free Cell. It's rather difficult in this game. You'll actually have an opportunity for a tutorial and some other stuff, and I'll show you that in a minute. The gameplay is you got to go from ace to king in the right suit, and you have to manipulate the cars. There's specific ways you can move them only black on the right or black on red in the right suit going upwards or downwards however you want to look at it and you have four spaces where you can hold cards again times on the bottom right and on the bottom left is your score your score goes down the longer it takes you tap on the arrow at the bottom and you have a lot of options especially undo so you can undo and it won't affect your stats if you abandon a game lots of other things you can do there Here's what you get whenever you go into any game. Information, rules, high scores. There's also an interactive tutorial which they walk you through and teach you how to play the game. Here's an example of it. As you go through, they tell you where to drag the card. They tell you what you're doing. Put the two on the three and the two on the three there and then the nine in the holding area. And that's an example. There's also a setting to change the table view, which is real interactive. It's table perspective. And when you do, the accelerometer or the iPad actually can move the table around. I'm moving my accelerometer around. That's how you get that effect. Again, there are stats for global statistics and standard, and you can clear them at any time. Now we're gonna go into another game. This is Spider, and you can see I'm in portrait mode. So this app works in landscape and portrait, and you can also have it on auto, which means it'll turn to either one just left on auto. Spider's a little different. You do the same. You're doing, you know, matching going from ace to king. Once you do that in a line, they'll all go into one of the spots where you see the A's, the capital A's at the top. And here's an example of that. You have to work your way through it. Tap on the card deck in the upper left to get new cards. To win the game, just clear away all of those spade cards into the capital letter A slots. Now we're going to go and check out Poker, Poker Solitaire. You're trying to play the best hand horizontal and vertical, well, making poker hands. Again, three of a kind, two of a kind, straight, flush, what have you. And again, you're scored going horizontal and vertical. Your score is in the bottom left and your time is on the bottom right. Your score is represented with dollars, in dollars. And you can see it's open, faint enabled in the upper left. You're going to get an animation at the end of a game. You can keep on playing three of a kind. I got a, I got a full house coming my way right there and you can find a lot of different hands kind of hard though to play both up and down you know trying to get the right hands now klondike is the other game that is free again free cell spider and klondike klondike is what i would consider free cell but apparently i'm wrong the draw pile is in the upper left your cards are in the far right and you're trying to again to go ace to king in the right suit once you get on a roll, you can see it's just putting the cards away in the right order. Your points are on the bottom left again, as well as your time. And you get a nice animation once you complete a game successfully. We got a one draw victory. Nice animation. Now let's go ahead and check out the options from the homepage. There are a lot of visual and audio options for all the different settings. There are auto, portrait, and landscape modes that you can play the game in. There's help. There's a lot of help for awards, controls, as well as the tutorials to learn how to play a game. If you don't know how to play, you can always find out. There are awards here. Lots of awards you can find and you can try to earn them all. Here are all the games. There are a large amount of games. Again, each game pack has eight. They cost 99 cents or you can get them all for $6.99. That's a lot of gameplay. That's it for this iPad app video demo. Until next time, Crazy Mike saying see ya.